I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Uh, no, you're not. Not in that. What are you wearing right now? A little black dress. That is unauthorized. <laughs> What's going on guys? So today we're going to do something a little different, uh, a little interesting if I do say so myself. I'm surprised we haven't done this sooner, but today my wife and I are going to get geared up. Now, what could I be talking about, babe? What gear am I talking mm, about? Maybe your combat gear or your training gear? Or I think what you gear? might be right there. So we're both about to get kitted up in my uh, army outfit and uh, gear. So that includes we've got two helmets, two IOTVs, which is the, what baby, what's an IOTV? Um, it's your body armor, essentially. Okay. Yeah. So what is the IOTV? Body armor. Yeah, baby. So, all right, so we're going to get suited up. First of all, babe, what is this you're wearing? A little black dress. Mm -mm. No, you can't wear that. You're going to have to get out of it. All right, let's fix it. Let's start you. Uh, how about this? All right, that's a lot better. What the heck? All right, babe, so now you are ready to put on the official body armor and helmet of the United States Army. Yeah, mm-hmm. Yeah. All right, so we've got her all squared away now. So, babe, the first thing that we're going to do is put on the body armor. You ready? Okay. All right, let's do it. All right. All right, so. I have to pick it up. Yes. It looks heavy. Well, mine is. Yours, hold on. Mine is because I've got everything on it and I've got actual plates in there. And these plates are rated for uh, 762 by 51. What does that mean? So it means that it can take an incoming round from like a 240 Bravo and AK 47. And then all I gotta do is got this little flap right here comes up. And then uh, buckle fasteners, push that in. Oh, hold on. Goes like so. You got the gist of it, babe? Comes back down. Okay. Uh, I forgot how you put it on. <laughs> <laughs> Noelle, it's okay, baby. She's yeah. like, Mommy, what are you wearing? <laughs> what are you holding? All right, babe. It's over my head. Yeah. All right, so take that. Here, let the, me. The opening seems so small. Like let me friend. do something that'll help you because it keeps up your hair. Yeah, her hair is not what we would call in rags, but I'm letting it go for now. There we go. shoulders. Noelle, it's okay, baby. What in the world are you wearing? <laughs> Look how she's looking. So that's what she was saying. It's like, what are you doing? Look your arm. Oh, that feels better. Mm -hmm. Okay. That turned towards me. Oh, so th this is super heavy without any plates. Do I have plates? You don't have any plates. You just have a uh, Kevlar lining in there that's ready for like 9 mil. Oh my gosh. Alright, I guess you buckled up there. This was the body armor that I wore to Afghanistan, baby. Well, yeah. Mm -hmm. This was. Cool. Well, this body armor has been on me since I was a private. You're telling me I'm standing here wearing the exact armor you wore in Afghanistan? Yeah. When they shot at you? Yeah. That's really cool and also kind of sad. Well, it's good luck. So, alrighty. So, her body armor is, well, it used to fit, well, it still fits me, but uh, as you can see, pretty much covers your entire body there. Now, 
honestly, play carriers are a whole lot nicer, but you use what you're issued, so this is what I was using. And as you can see, it kind of comes in under your armpits there. Yeah. Gets pretty hot during the summer, too. Uh, yeah, I can <laughs> imagine. That's a model. How about that parade rest? I'm just kidding, babe. Nobody does that here. All right. He is... makes me salute him, <laughs> and he makes me go at attention, y'all. This is what I've got going on here. You can see I've got my. Uh, well, excuse me. I've got something called a IFAC back here. And then I've got my magazine pouches and a sustainment pouch up top. Canteen pouch, which I use for night vision goggles. And then another magazine pouch. So this was a, well, this is a third generation IOTV. And what does that mean? It's just a generation that, this is a fourth gen, this is a third gen. So this is newer? Newer, yeah. But uh, anyways, you can see it has this Kevlar lining that comes around. Uh, you would typically put your plates in. Uh, this one goes in from the bottom and in the back. This is so heavy and it doesn't have anything. <laughs> and in the back you put in your plate back here. Oh. Yeah. What are the plates for? The plates are for 7.62 uh, for supposedly stopping them. But they're rated up to 7.62 by 51, which could theoretically stop a uh, incoming 240 round. PKM round, but you know, maybe an AK 47 round. You were saying all this stuff, <laughs> I'm just seeing like glitter and unicorns because it doesn't make sense. I know what an AK 47 is. Yeah. Alright, babe, so you've got this on now. How are you feeling so far? My shoulders hurt already. Oh, baby, wait till you put plates in. No. <laughs> so, yours, um, I used to have a setup like this on yours mm -hmm. but whenever I got the fourth gen I moved it all over um, and then what you could do is use something called an IFAC which goes over your kit so I'll kind of show you how it would go just take this don't be disgusted by that. I'm not disgusted I'm <laughs> just sad because it looks like more heavy stuff <laughs> So it goes over like that, and then it fits on across like so, and then you'd have like buckles uh, mollied in to your IOTV, and that's how your setup would go. And you could put all your magazines right there. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> what? I didn't think about joining the army, y'all think I'm ready. Yeah, you got your little first aid kit right here. I've got my Oh, is first... my stuff in here? Yeah, these are these are IFAC, so you've got your first aid kit. Uh, yeah, you can go ahead and explore in there. I'll show you. You wanna take this off, babe? Here, I'll make you wear it for this. <sighs> I thought it was gonna relieve some of the pressure, but it didn't. <laughs> Open it up like so. It's got a little bungee cord. It looks funny whenever like these things pop open and you're in the middle of a field training exercise and it's just going like. That does look funny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's why you put a rubber band around it to secure it. Oh, okay. So. Let me look. see if this first aid kit is nurse approved. So we've got an NPA here. Okay. And uh, these one size fits all. So these. it's just like. In an emergency, I mean, yes. it really doesn't matter. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, let's see, you've got here some gloves in this little compartment right there. You've got your compressed gauze. Uh, we've got emergency hemorrhage bandages there. Okay. I'm trying to keep it so, like, yeah. I, I've kept it this way for a long time. And then this looks like. Uh, tape so yeah okay. so what do you think is this nurse approved tell me what all you see in there the, the only thing I'm concerned about is what are you, the main thing because you have something to compress you have something to bandage it mm -hmm. you got something to help 
with bleeding and you have an airway, mm -hmm. where's some, like, something to keep it all clean? Where to keep it all clean? You have you? an antiseptic? Antiseptic? Yeah. Uh, you know, I don't think so. <laughs> I, I think, <laughs> babe, I think in, uh, in this particular situation, the medics carry all the antiseptics. Oh, okay. But this okay. is just meant to be like... Until the medics get there. Yeah, fast okay. care. Okay. So yeah, your 68 whiskeys will typically have uh, more goodies than... Gotcha, that makes yeah. sense. So yeah, that's your iPad. Hmm. I think that stands for Infantry First Aid Kit. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah that makes sense. So, from Improvised First Aid Kit, you have to forgive me. Alright, so, next step. Hey, are you ready? What's the next step? Helmet. Okay. So. Wait, why is my rank empty? Because, baby, you're just a little fuzzy. <laughs> no, I want that one. No, baby, you gotta earn this one. <laughs> no, just give it to me. <laughs> it don't work that way, baby. No, yeah, I man. should automatically get it because you have it. I'll give you a light, little smiley sticker. <laughs> no, I want that one. Mm -mm. I want the same one you have. No, baby, you gotta earn it. Look. If you want to get some rank, we can do some push-ups later in the bedroom, but, uh, right now... Oh my god! <laughs> now with how my shoulders are hurting from this thing. You're doing good so far, babe. Uh, Alright, so, next part. Is this weird for y'all to see me like this? Did you ever think you would see me dressed like this? <laughs> me. Did yeah. you ever feel like you would be dressed like this? No. I didn't. Yeah. Alright, babe, so your next okay. piece. Your helmet. Okay. Here is also the original helmet I wore into Afghanistan. It's been on plenty of jumps as well. Alright babe, so with that, I donned this helmet. This is a size extra large. Oh my. Yeah. You got a big old head. I do. <laughs> <laughs> it's so heavy. Why is everything so heavy? I feel like instantly I feel like my head went backwards. Alright, and uh, just that. And see, this is why. Oh my God! Let's go backwards, <laughs> man. And this is why you gotta get your hair like pulled back in a bun. Uh, yeah, this is this is uh, this is why your uh, current hairstyle is unauthorized, babe. No, why y'all? Why aren't they letting the girls look cute out there? You can't do that, babe. You get caught on something, you get caught in your body armor. It can be pulled back like that and tucked in. To my shirt. No, do not tuck it into your shirt. Why? Because... <laughs> <laughs> Baby, it's not even supposed to be like on your... Hut! Two, three! Hut! <laughs> Hut! <laughs> Hut! <laughs> Alright, babe, so I'll put mine on. I feel like you could take on anything now. I feel like I'm ready uh, to take it off. Alright, so here's mine. Yeah, this was this. Uh, what I'm wearing right now is my uh, rack deployment gear. So, yeah, I've got it set up like this. Um, as you can see, I put a little camo netting on there. And then inside, I think if y'all can flash back to prior vlogs, you'll remember that I had this in my helmet at all times downrange. Why? I just. Always have a good thought before you put your helmet on. Mm -hmm. Remember what you're trying to get back to. Mm -hmm. So, put our helmet on. Fasten it up. Alright, so, babe, we're not done yet. Uh, what else we got? We have to have protective eye eyewear. Okay. Or eye pro, as we call it. So Ooh, this helmet is heavy. <laughs> so here is your eye pro. Okay. And I'll show y'all like different ones. She's just wearing your standard eye pro. It's just ballistic glasses, pretty much. Model it, baby. You better work. <laughs> you better work. <laughs> You're killing it. Last one on the field. All right, and then I'll put on. Actually, don't get to wear these that often, but uh, these Ooh. are goggles. Mm-hmm. 
Those look like VR glasses. <laughs> well, they're thick, but it's meant for uh, being up in a turret. What, what is that? Like uh, on a Humvee or a oh, wrap okay. or something like that. You know those like uh, 50 cals that sit up on top of there? Uh, whenever they're driving, you've got this, so it uh, protects your eyes from like sand, wind, uh, stuff getting kicked up, anything like that. This is the face is like, like <laughs> no idea what you're talking about. It's okay, baby. I'm sorry. That's I'm trying to learn. You are doing, you're being a great student, baby. I'm going to loosen this up. <laughs> We've got our iPro on. She's got your standard ballistic glasses. I've got my uh, goggles on. And uh, to be honest, I prefer my iPro. It's a lot easier to work with. So, so don't, don't look at my stuff because everything on me is modified. Sean is the one that is official. So. Don't be like, Sierra, your hell is not clothing. Just look at Sean, okay? Be like Sean. <laughs> <laughs> well, all right, babe. So I'm going to go ahead and let you get fully kitted up here. Here are your gloves. Oh. You're going to have to take your ring off. <gasps> you have to take your ring off? No, I get to keep mine because it's a simple one. Uh. Okay. I'll hold it. And keep the summer safe. <laughs> See, look. <laughs> Here's your other glove. Okay, what are these for? That is just to keep your hands protected. Okay. Helps against burns, cuts, abrasions. Hmm. I seen safety. <laughs> can you see me? <laughs> oh wait. Does he say can you see me or you can't see me? Pretty sure it's you can't you see me. You can't see me. <laughs> you can't see me. Alright, let me stop. You feeling yourself now, baby? Uh a little bit. What I'm not feeling is my shoulders because they're going numb, but <laughs> 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 Yeah, so welcome to the uh, PPE of the uh, 82nd Airborne. Oh, I would show him the PPE of the nurse during a pandemic, but you know, we need all our gowns, gloves, and eyewear we can get, so we don't have any spare. Well, like, I mean, I've seen uh, y'all wear like those full face masks, like painting masks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we, we've, got, uh, we've got those styles of masks. Yeah, it's like the full, you know, oh, yeah. biohazard looking yes. mask with the dual yeah. filters right there. Okay. Yeah. Mm. Well, all right. So, baby, you were such a good participant today. Uh, maybe Thank we'll you. put some rank on you today. So. <laughs> Babe, you hit me so hard. Hold on. Okay. Cause my shoulders are already leaning <laughs> forward, and when you hit me, I just okay. I'm good. I'm good. Okay. I'm good. Well, maybe we'll. Okay, probably not. But <laughs> just take my rank back. Just cause I fell. That is not nice. Oh, all right. You want? Some, okay. How about some ibuprofen and some water? <laughs> no, I want to be. A, I want uh, the rank above yours. The rank above mine? Yeah. Staff sergeant? Yes. No. <laughs> you gotta earn that one too. Mm. It's alright, babe. You're all PB'd up. You ready to go uh, out to the range? Yeah, let's go. 
All right, baby. So I think the next thing that we're gonna do just for fun is, uh, baby, come up, come up here. <laughs> I have to lean forward when I walk because otherwise my helmet tilts me back. So, all right, and so I can't. I, if I'm looking all crazy, y'all, I'm sorry. These glasses for some reason are making me look like I'm like I'm looking up here and over there. I don't know why. <laughs> so. It's also, you know, this, this hair is, you know, it's way out of rags, babe, you know. He is really, he really, <laughs> I'm in trouble because yeah. Sean wanted me to make a bun and I said. We're going to be doing uh, a little uh, extra curricular PT later. No! <laughs> a little concurrent training, if you will. <laughs> Sorry, right, babe. Uh, did you have fun? I did. All yeah, right. it's, it's interesting to, you know, walk through and kind of see what all you put on and why. Yeah. And uh, so I think another fun little challenge that we're going to do now is, uh, babe, I've got some face paint down here. Uh, what I was thinking is how about you try to cam when we up? Okay. All right. So we're going to let her try to camo paint me up. You think you're going to be able to get a good intimidating face paint going? I don't see why not. Alright, well. Look out, you're gonna be getting. Look out, you're gonna be doing uh, camo painting tutorials from now on. <laughs> if you do really good on this, though. So. Alright. Alright, so. We're gonna. Get out of these real quick, and babe, we're gonna try the camo painting my husband challenge. Ooh. Is that what we can call it? What do you think? Yeah, I think that's a good name. We're, we'll call it the camo paint challenge. <laughs> <laughs> All right, babe. So you go ahead and start breaking down. Okay. Definitely breaking down. <laughs> You're doing good, baby. Mm. Thank That first time is always rough. <sighs> All right, guys. So I hope you've enjoyed it so far. Uh, let's see how my wife does on this camel paint. <laughs> 